So AMP is falling like London bridges. AMP is falling like Beyonce off stage, which was hilarious. But should you be worried? Keep watching, man. Check this out. I'm going to show you AMP's history. I'm going to show you history of crypt uh, cryptos that started out similar to this that are pumping now so you can put your foot in your mouth and be the hell quiet if you're a disbeliever. On this channel, we talk about hodling on things that are actually worth it. Okay, so watch this. Okay, so Alexander, or whatever this dude's name is, said it's just a crap coin. Amp is just a crap coin. And then this smart brother right here says, Don't judge so hard. I saw a lot of crap coins in 2017, which are already famous now. It's a game, nothing else. Bars. I say that is bars. Okay, now let me show you some. Okay, now. After this, I'm going to show you some cryptocurrencies that are pumping right now that started in 2017, just to back up what the brother was saying on there. If you guys are amateur investors, then of course, when you just look at the daily charts like these other investors or, or holders or just YouTubers, period, try to sit here and convince you that you can predict it by seeing what's happening right here. You can only predict it by seeing what's happening in the background and the white papers and the roadmap through usage cases. That's how you make your predictions the correct way. Okay, but anyway, right here, it's been here for a while. And as you see that AMP and Flex is not flinching, that's because they're laying the groundwork. Uh, Rome wasn't built in a dang on day. These are not crap coins. These are tokens that are planning for world domination, new world order in the payments industry. Okay, replacing the dollar like cryptocurrency was intended to do in the first place before traders infiltrated and just started swapping and selling every freaking day. Okay. It's supposed to replace the dollar. Now, when I'm about to get to a couple of cryptocurrencies that started in 2017, but before that, look, the price is this. If you can't hold, then chances are you need to just go ahead and go off. The scripture in the Bible says the ones that endure to the end will be the ones that get rewarded. It says in the scripture that is better. The end of a thing is better than the beginning of a thing. So right now, this, this is the beginning, man. And it doesn't look all that good for you if you just sell and swap and trade. Okay, but guess what? <clears throat> This is one that started in 2017 that everybody thought would just stop doing it, but it eventually got up right now. It's up right now and it's $5. So that's pretty decent, right? EOS. We're going to go over a couple after this that you've heard of before. So keep watching. Okay. So I'm pretty sure you heard of this. Uh, I haven't read up too much on what this one actually is. I just know that it started back then and a lot of people doubted it as well. But you can't tell unless you know what's going on behind the scenes, guys. That's what I'm trying to teach you on this channel. I'm not a crypto pro and all of that, but I am a business pro. And I know that on the surface, sometimes uh, it looks like a business is doing bad. Oh, it's not many customers going in there. Chances are they might just be remodeling on the inside of that restaurant. You thought that they were shutting down. So you don't know what's going on behind the dang on scenes now. We're going to close this one out and get to the next one. Boom. All right. So this one is at 11. All right. This is trying and it's doing pretty good. This one started in 2017 as well as I, as I Googled, I Googled these guys. I, like I said, I only been in crypto this year. Uh, I do real business. I own real business and these are startups right now. All right, so this, is, this project is best described as a decentralized platform focused on content sharing and entertainment. And to this end, one of its biggest acquisitions was the file sharing service BitTorrent back in uh, 2018. If you guys know what BitTorrent is, it's, it was a, a file sharing platform, like they just said, where you can watch all the latest movies for free. You can download them. You can download full albums and a lot of people were downloading porn and doing all that extra stuff. <laughs> I ain't going to point no elbows. All right. So this one is doing decently. It's 11 cents. If you don't give up, if you hold, okay? It said, if you faint not in the scriptures, then you would literally be rewarded at the end. Okay, so we're going to X out of trying. Now, next, we got this one that everybody knows. Boom. <laughs> wow. Okay. This is Bitcoin Cash. All right. Everybody thought this was going to be a piece of crap from what I read, okay? And it's up, you know, it's up a little bit. But look how much it is worth. 
Bitcoin Cash is worth 642, doing pretty well for something that people didn't believe would go anywhere. Okay, so the point we're trying to emphasize is that you can't freaking tell uh, uh, right now at the inception of a cryptocurrency it, what it's going to be. If it doesn't have a, right, a white paper or a roadmap, then you can call it a crap coin. If it doesn't have a plan and it's just based off social media hype, then you can call it a crap coin. But you can't call it a crap coin if it has an awesome laid out plan and roadmap like uh, Flex or Amp and like ACH. You know what I'm saying? I talk about them because I'm in love with the roadmap and I'm in love with the implementation of their partnerships and everything. They've been doing the collaborations and everything. So this is a startup. These are startup companies proving my point that it takes a few years for the ones that's really worth something to become what they're supposed to become. All right. So now, last but not least, we're going to go to this one that you all have been talking about lately. Boom. Cardano. Now, $2.49. Okay. And it's up. Every Notice how every last one I've shown you today was up. All of them are up. All the way up with my fat Joe gang. You know what I'm saying? Like, all of them are up. You know what I'm saying? And these are ones that people thought were crap coins. All right. In my opinion, some of them might still be crap. But as far as what you guys are interested in, which is just paying attention to the price so that you can sell or buy in and stuff, then obviously these these ones are valuable and they're doing pretty good. Right. So, hey, do a Jet Li sidekick to the like button if you've been edified today and you understand that you can't just go off of the daily.